They're connected by one of the worst atrocities of the 20th century. But for these Holocaust survivors, today was mostly an occasion to celebrate. The 25th birthday of the Sydney Jewish Museum, an institution which has helped them heal by confronting the trauma of their past. It hasn't been easy. The first time I was here, when I came home, I couldn't sleep, I couldn't eat. Every memory came back. Their stories to museum visitors, many of them school children, providing important lessons. I witnessed the most horrible time in the history of mankind. I cannot and will not forgive or forget, but I don't hate. Friendships forged partly by what they've endured. The people that went through, we have that close connection. We, we know exactly how we felt and how terrible it was. 43 Holocaust survivors are still actively involved here at the museum. They feature in photographs in this special gallery, most with items they brought from that time. For Eddie, it's a leather belt. It held up his trousers at four concentration camps, including Auschwitz. He's worried, though, that the world hasn't learned. When I open the TV and I hear the fighting each other and killing and children and burning, I say, what's going on? A new exhibition at the museum will keep a focus on such atrocities. We will deal with human rights violations during the Holocaust but also violations of human rights as they're occurring in modern society today. These survivors conceding they can't change what has happened, but adamant they can help change the future. Helen Espista, SBS World News.